Green Springs, Adams, and Pleasant Townships are all joining Seneca County. Well, new tonight from Seneca County, the final piece of the puzzle was just added there. A levy that voters passed in November is generating $1.6 million annually to support the new Seneca County EMS district, adding full-time emergency medical services throughout the county. Now we're going to hear from 13 Action News reporter J.D. Pooley with the story all new at 5. Seneca County EMS continues to expand. Officials say that will open the door for faster response times throughout the county. The all-volunteer fire department in the village of Green Springs in the northern end of Seneca County only has two volunteer EMS firefighters on hand. More unified being under Seneca County since we are in Seneca County. Um, we enjoy having them here. We work together with them very well. That unity was the goal of Seneca County Commissioner Tony Paradiso when he made a push for a levy request, which voters passed to strengthen the EMS services throughout the county that has over 50,000 residents. And those dollars coupled with commissioner dollars uh, form Seneca County EMS. Now that Green Springs has joined, Commissioner Paradiso says that brings together six villages and 11 townships, all under one EMS district. That includes 16 full-time employees. So our response time have improved. Our goal was 10 minutes or less. And the way we do that is we have to strategically place these facilities so we can get the best reach in the county uh, with the quickest times. The first EMS building is currently being constructed and set to open in April. For now, Seneca County EMS staff will work from the Green Springs Fire Department. By, by adding this last component in the county, it kind of brings the resources into the county. Having ALS advanced life support available to all the residents within the county in the shortest amount of time possible. In the village of Green Springs, J.D. Pooley, 13 Action News. In a crime